Hey guys, this is Toby. Toby is a Maltese and a Yorkie mix. I'm gonna give you a little bit of a tutorial today on his haircut. Um, Toby does not get a bath when he comes here because we found that whenever he was being fully groomed, he would go home and he would puke a lot and the owners didn't know why he was always getting sick. And I realized that it was because he was getting so stressed out from the blow dryer that he was going home and the rest of the evening he wouldn't be feeling well because he stressed himself out. So I asked the owners to bathe him first and then bring him in for a groom. And when we did that, we realized that he was no longer having these issues. So he's very afraid of the dryer. So we just don't do that part. And I just do his haircut. So he's already been bathed at home and let's get started. Oh, I see that there's a home haircut on your face. That's going to be interesting to blend in. Okay, so I'm going to start with a number four blade. Whenever I do Yorkie type coats, I always use a skip tooth blade. I find that they work the best. I find if I use a full tooth blade, it never really comes out um, nicely. So I'm going to start first on his belly. You know, you're a big sucky baby, Cody. Sorry, Toby the Clipper was really loud today. So the reason why the Clipper is so loud is because I am using an AGS blade on a wall clipper. So wall clippers are typically, you wanna use wall blades, but I don't like wall blades, but I like wall clippers. So they still work, but they happen to be really obnoxiously loud, unfortunately. So Yorkies can have a really difficult coat to work with and sometimes it's better to shave them in reverse. So I'm gonna try to use one of my blades in reverse right now just to see if it comes out a little better. Mm, this is a lot quieter too. Yeah, so this is coming out a lot more even. Okay, buddy. So I don't typically do the legs in a reverse. I'll shave the legs the proper way. Um, just because it can be a little difficult to do legs in reverse, especially on a Yorkie whose legs are so thin and these are so wide apart that I really don't want to get in there like that on their bones. So I prefer to just shave the body in reverse and then the legs I can make even using thinning shears. Okay, and now I will shave his legs in a number four.
he has back dew claws, so I have to be really careful when I shave his legs not to shave off his toenail because that can definitely happen. It's really important when you're grooming any dog, especially a new dog that you've never done before, to feel to see if they have those first before shaving. Okay, so for sanitary shave, I'm gonna shave his area down there in a 10 and his bump. Okay, and I'm gonna shave just the tips of his ears in a number 10. Now I am gonna do his face first and then I will do his paws and his nails. So I'm just gonna comb everything out before I start. Toby, are you a big baby? Are you a big sucky baby? Mm, you're fine. You're so cute. All right, so I'm gonna trim everything over his visor. And then using my thinning shears, I'm just gonna tidy that up. And then using my straights, I'm just gonna do the hair in between his eyes. Sorry, buddy. Now the owners have chopped a lot of the hair on his face here, so I'm probably gonna take his face shorter than I normally would, just to make sure I can blend it all in, but they like his face short anyway, so I guess it doesn't really matter. So I'm gonna take the corner of his face here and using my fingers, I'm gonna hold that and just chop that right off. And I'm gonna do the same thing on this side. And then his beard here is very uneven, so I'm gonna take my thinning shears and even that out. And then I'm going to blend some of this in that they chopped at with my thinning shears. Good boy, Toby, good boy, I know. Sorry, buddy. Okay, and with his ears, I'm gonna even out the tips. Thank you. 
and I want his ear hair to blend into his face. So everybody does things differently, but I like to hold the hair like this and kind of fan it in there. It's the best way for me to explain it. So you just kind of go on in an angle. Anybody? And I'm going to blend that in with thinning shears. It's okay. It's okay. Such a big sucky baby. You're a big sucky baby. This is how I check to see if their ears are even. Looks pretty good. I can we really, I find it very difficult to work on Yorkie fur. It's just never lays nice, but we do the best we can, right, Toby? Right? Okay, now I'm going to do his nails and then legs and paws. The only nails that ever really need clipping are his dew claws and he hates having them clipped because they are so freaking long. Okay, buddy, it's okay. These ones are usually fairly short. It's okay. It's okay, buddy. It's okay, you're a good boy. You're a good boy. Yeah, I know you hate it. I know that one there was touching his pad. So when I clipped it, it hurt. I didn't clip the nail too short, but I unfortunately had to touch the skin with the clippers. Sometimes those nails, they, they really suck. It's okay, buddy. And I just got a nail in the eyeball. That's great. Stay. Good boy. One more. One more nail. Actually, it's really short. Okay. Okay. So I'm going to show you about his paws in my five in one. So I'm just going to tidy up his paws. See that some of his body hair here is not even, so I'm just going to even that out with my thinning shears.
Okay, so I'm spraying him down in fluff off um, blueberry bubblegum cologne. This is my new line of grooming products. Brand new bottle. Okay, buddy. And I'm going to give him a very special little Christmas decoration. I gotta fix this. I swear, Yorkies, whenever you think you're done, you're not done. Your hair just likes to pop out on ya. Okay, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed Toby's transformation. Look how freaking cute he is. I will be back next week with another video. Let me know if there's any of my clients that you guys have seen that you really wanna see in these longer form content videos. And I have to fix that hair that's on top of his ears. Toby, wanna go home? Wanna go for a walk? Wanna go in the car? Okay, let's go Toby.